With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, let us start with our question. In this question, what is given? The position time graph of two children A and B returning from their school O to their o homes P and Q respectively along two straight line, uh, two straight uh, path as shown in the figure. Now we need to choose the correct statement. Okay, so uh, so this is the path for uh, this is the path for B and this is for A. Now they are returning from their school, so school as uh, is at A and their homes are at position respectively P and Q. Okay. Now A lives closer to the school than B. So in the A statement, so what is the uh, home for home for A? Home for A is what is P and home for home for B. B is what? It is equals to Q. So which distance is greater OP or OQ? Clearly we can see that OQ is greater than OP. That means A would be, we can say that A would be closer as compared to B. So B home is farther from the school. This is the school and these, these are their home. So A statement is the correct statement. Now if we check our B statement, in the B statement, A start from the school, uh, uh, school earlier than B. So when does A start? A starts, A starts, when does A start? So A is starting at t equals to 0. Okay, from here A is starting at this time. And when B is starting, B starts at t is equals to t1. So at t equal to t equals to t1, t, uh, uh, this uh, B is starting. So who is take, who is earlier starting? It is A because it is starting at t equals to 0. That means B is also correct. Now in the C option, in the C option, it is saying that uh, A and B have uh, equal average velocity from 0 to t0. So average velocity, we say that average velocity, V average would be equals to total displacement, total displacement upon total time. Now the time for both is same, it is equals to t0. t0 minus 0 would be equals to t0. So time is same. So average velocity would depend upon the displacement. Now if we see for A, what is the displacement? It is just equals to OP. What for B, what is the displacement? It is equals to OQ. So if displacement is different, so the average velocity would be what? Different. Why? Because we have to uh, uh, check for the same time. So denominator would be same, but numerator would be different. That means they would be having unequal or we can say that different velocities. Now here it is uh, said that under D option, B overtakes A on the way. So we see, now we see here that at certain amount of time, let's say at T time, we, uh, we can see that this uh, A and B are crossing. So initially A was traveling a greater distance. Okay, we can say that A, now T, uh, B is started at T1. Now after some time, since velocity of B is more, we can see here the slope is more, angle is more here, while uh, angle for A is less. That means slope for A is less, A is traveling with lesser speed. Now at t equals to certain time about of this time t2, let's say t2. So these both are crossing. After that A is traveling at a farther distance as compared to B. So we can say that D overtakes A on the way. Uh, sorry, B overtakes uh, A on the way at a time t2. So this statement is also correct. So correct option are A, then B and then D. So hope you have understood the solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.